love. Mr. Hendrick, sir. I couldn't have a quick word with my boy, could I? I won't be long, I promise. As long as it is quick. So you're heading off again, are you? Hmm. Well, just you be sure to listen to Sir Hendrick and do as you're told. And don't you dare go giving up, ever. Just look at me, eh? Something's wrong with my eyes now, too. Must be all this squinting in the dark. Well, only one remedy for that. You'll just have to bring back the light. Promise? Time is short. We must be on our way. You'll look after my boy, won't you, Sir Hendrick? Hmm. Obsidian, see the lady back to safety. So, the assault begins. Move. This is no time for idling.
Even the great stairway lies in ruins. The usurper will be in the throne room, if he is anywhere. He must be found and punished, which means we must seek another way up. Come, Jasper, do your worst. If you insist. Curse you, Hendrik. Root strength wins the day again. It is good to see two young men with such spirit. Huh? Mm -hmm. But I order you to cease your horseplay and greet our latest arrival. I present Princess Jade. Oh. Hmm. When you grow older, you will be the guardians of this great kingdom. I am counting on you. And now, so is she. <laughs> With my might and your wisdom, we will surely be the greatest knights this kingdom has ever seen. Long... Jasper, are you listening to me? What is this? Why, the shield of Heliodor, of course. Symbol of the kingdom's greatest knights. His majesty keeps it in his private chambers. If we are destined to become such men one day, one of us will surely wear it. I would very much like to see it, wouldn't you? <laughs> and how do you propose to do that? One cannot simply stroll into the king's chambers uninvited. Oh, I have my ways. I just so happen to spy a certain someone treating himself to a midnight feast in the kitchens. None other than his royal majesty. He slithered out of a secret passage behind a cupboard and set about the leftovers. That passage must lead to his chambers. <laughs> you devil! You've solved the mystery of his bulging belly. The queen will make you an earl for such a service to the kingdom. We meet in the kitchen at midnight. Agreed? Agreed. Of course. The passage to the King's Chambers. But... what was that? A vision? A dream? So this is your power, Luminary? Y you are able to draw on the memories amassed within the World Tree? To pry into others' pasts. Very impressive. The kitchen is on the north side of the castle, beyond the banqueting hall. Come.
well that ends well. I did not make it here that night, you know. I was caught trying to slip out of my chambers. The king made me polish all the armor in the castle. Jasper was disgusted with me. We had a furious argument. We had so many in those days. But there was more happiness than strife. Life was simple. We had a purpose. We would have stood together in defense of Heliodor no matter what. I have treated you poorly. Forgive me. My loyalties have been tested, but not by you. Whatever lies ahead, we must face it together. Will you stand beside me? Hmm. You have done well to make it here, old friend. And with the Darkspawn in tow, no less. Oh, bravo. Jasper. Temper, temper. Brute force may have won the day once upon a time, but things are very different now. Why? Why did you give yourself to the darkness? What of our pact? We swore fealty to Heliodor. We promised to protect the kingdom, together! Why? You, of all people, ask me why? <laughs> Does something amuse you, traitor? It is I who must ask you why, surely. Why is it that you always thought yourself so much better than me? Why? 
why was it always you who was given the golden opportunities? Why was it always you who got just what you wanted? Why? Hmm? Tell me why! No more. I will be second best no longer. I know the truth now. Love, dreams, light, friendship, all these count for naught. All that matters is power. And the only power that matters is that of the darkness. There is one who sees the worth in me, who deserves my fealty, who gives me the power I crave, and all who stand in his way must be destroyed! I lost my hometown. My family, my friends, all to the dark power that you serve. I lost my faith, my purpose. Though some called me hero, I believed I was a fraud and that I was powerless to protect them. But I can protect them. I must. And there is one I must protect above all others. It is the Luminary's duty to deliver the world from evil, and it is my duty to protect him! Jasper, you are a traitor to your kingdom, a servant of evil, and a threat to the servant of light! I sentence you to death! <laughs> really, old friend? Forgive me if I do not begin quaking just yet. Now let us end this farce. <laughs> you will outdo me no longer, Hendrik. This time, it is I who have been chosen, and you who will fade into obscurity. <laughs> Jasper. <laughs> Oh, 
friends. Eternal night awaits! <laughs> Thank you.
victory is ours. Obsidian, thank the heavens I have one truly faithful friend. The darkness may have dissipated, but we cannot know what toll the battle took. We must return to the last bastion and see what, if anything, remains. Someone! Anyone! Your Majesty! Please. Somebody! Wait. That noise. You did it, Hendrik. You saved us all. Out of my way! Let me through! Let me look at you in the daylight at last. Oh, yes! 
my handsome little soldier, my hero. Just look at you. <laughs> you set aside your differences with Hendrik. With me. And fought to bring back the light. We are forever in your debt. The world is still in a desperate state. But now we have something. We have hope. We have the luminary. May you banish the darkness once and for all. Hendrik, my ever faithful knight. Today's victory is as much yours as anyone's. Your strength too will be needed in the struggle to free the world from evil. You know what you must do. The people of the last bastion will learn to make do without you. As I hope will I. <laughs> so please, do not hesitate. Do what you know you must. Honored Luminary, I serve you now. Though it cost me my life, I will stand beside you until the darkness is no more. in Heliodor. The first victory in the fight against the darkness is ours! I trust that you slept well? Or did the people perhaps not permit you the luxury of rest, eh? <laughs> or even better? There is no surer sign of a kingdom at peace than a high-spirited populace. Now, to more serious matters. Hendrik, there is something I wish you to have. <sighs> the shield of Heliodor. Sire, you are like a son to me. And it is a father's duty to prepare his offspring for the dangers that await them. You will have need of it, I am sure. You wear it well. The shield has always been the mark of our mightiest knights. There can be none mightier than the Luminary's own guardian. You have no complaints, I trust. No, my liege. 
I understand that you had hoped for the World Tree to guide you on your quest. Alas, it is no more. But all hope is not lost. Your father once told me that Yggdrasil was not the only sacred place in Adria. He spoke of another, a holy mountain in the south known as Pang Lai. The fate of those who dwell there is deeply intertwined with that of the luminary, or so he said. It may be mere hearsay, a conversation half remembered, but if it is true, you may yet find help in your quest to defeat the Lord of Shadows. Venture west through the Mangle Grove, and you will find a valley that leads to the Cost of Alor. Pass through the checkpoint beyond it, and you will soon find Mount Pang Lai. It is not a road I have traveled myself. Be prepared, and may your journey be a safe one.